Okie dokie, we are right now going to create a Facebook group if you haven't done this before. So we're just on my regular profile and down the left hand side you're going to see groups. I'm just going to click on that, then create a group. And then it's all easy from there. You're going to give it a name. So let's just call this a test group. Um, normally you need to add some people. I usually just add myself. Um, here we go. And it's a closed group and I'm going to uh, pin it to shortcuts. If this is a group that you're going to be using for, for example, um, you know, you're running a, a program, which is what you're probably going to be using it for, you want to pin it to the shortcut so you can find it nice and easily. Then click on create. Then you want to add a little um, token. I always have one of these just because I've usually got a bunch of um, groups sitting there and I like to be able to see it nice and far. So let's just go, um, this is a test one, so I'm going to use something I haven't used before. Okay. Upload the photo. Uh, I created one earlier. Just want to drag that into position. Save the changes. Now normally what I do with any group, especially if it's for a program in particular, is I create a pinned post. So it would be, for example, um, you know, attention please and then or it might say something like um, welcome please read and then you're going to add you know the bits of, the bits and pieces that you need under there with any links that need to go in there obviously I'm just typing googly goop there sometimes you might want to add a photo there just so that people um, would we'll pay more attention to it and then you're just going to post all right I also add the description as well so I usually would just say this group is for a paid program you can go here and then add the link to sign up whoops to sign up so that's what I would do. Obviously, I would add the link in there. Uh, and then I would maybe add some description here. And that would normally just be a cut and paste of whatever the pinned post is. I'm just going to click on the image. I'm going to add description. And then I'm going to post that same information just so that it's there for people to see um, nice and easily. And there you have it. You have your group. And then if you want the page... You just grab the URL here with it. you need to you could also go to um, discussion and that'll take you to the link so you grab the link and then this is what you get to attach to all the things so for example when you signed up to the program uh, and you logged on to the member homepage you would have clicked on the link to, that took you to the Facebook group and that would have just been by using that link there. And that is how you create a Facebook group.